North Korea's Supreme Court on Sunday sentenced a 24-year-old American man to six years of hard labor for entering the country illegally to commit espionage. Showing no emotion throughout the 90-minute trial, Matthew Miller waived the right to a lawyer and was handcuffed before being led from the courtroom after his sentencing. The court said Miller tore up his tourist visa at Pyongyang's airport upon arrival on April 10th and admitted to wanting to experience prison life so that he could secretly investigate North Korea's human rights situation. Earlier, it was believed that Miller had sought asylum when he entered North Korea, but the prosecution argued that was a ruse. During an interview with the Associated Press last month, Miller publicly appealed for help. I am now requesting help from the American government, the citizens of America, and the world to release me from this situation. The Supreme Court also ruled it would not hear any appeals to its decision. Miller is one of three Americans being held in North Korea. Jeffrey Fowle is awaiting trial after leaving a Bible at a sailor's club, and Kenneth Bay is serving out a 15-year sentence for alleged hostile acts. Matthew Burgoyne, Associated Press.